Okay, okay. and, 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 and so well, this, this is my th- well, hold, hold on now, hold on now. The thing is, the thing is, you're asking a man to prove it. No, she the one making the claim. It is her responsibility to prove that it happened. You as a defendant, all you got to do is sit there and say nothing. She got to come over proof that you actually took it. And we don't want to put that onus on her. That's what's going on in this conversation. We don't want to put the onus on the woman that it is her job to actually prove it. If you're making an accusation and it's your job to prove your case, any woman who wants to prove I did it, she got to figure out how to come up with that proof. It's that simple at the end of the day. If you ain't got no proof, I ain't got time to hear your story. Now, we are prosecuting all that because it's the legal thing to do. But at the end of the day, if men won't accept a woman has to provide proof, you're asking to be messed with. Right. Why is it so hard for us to accept the woman needs to provide the proof? I, it's but not. That's- I want to work off of I want to work off of your statement earlier about you recording these encounters because I think that's that's interesting. Um, no, no. Remember, I said that's what she gonna have to do. I agree. I'm she not talking about you, Roger. To... I'm not talking about you, Roger. I agree. I, I'm not saying that you may. You know, this is so we're, we're caught in between a rock and a hard place, and you may not see it. You may not be aware. No, I don't see it at all. I it's don't see it at all. It's not black and white. Yeah, it's, it, it's only not black and white because men won't accept that women should have to have the same standard that we got to have. But That's the only agree. reason it ain't black and white. I totally agree, Roger. But in the situation for, for reality, as it currently is, as a person who's currently looking at 25 years in prison for a girl I didn't even have sex with, the point is, is it's not black and white when it comes to the practicality of but, everything. I'm sitting in no, the no, courtroom. I, I, Go ahead. But, but nice sometimes. Think about it, though. If if the man simply accepted what the standard on the law says, she got to prove it beyond a reasonable doubt. If the men accepted that standard, you wouldn't even be going through this, would you? I don't. The problem is men and men, unmarried people spend too much time with each other, <laughs> and that's the reason why. <laughs> and that's the reason why in yeah. the past people prohibited. Unescorted uh, uh, or unchaperoned time uh, amongst people, you know, alone. That that's a, because, again, it, you're never gonna you. Again, if you can have sex with if you if you can have a sexual assault, and there's no physical trauma associated with that event, you ain't proven shit. And so now you're asking a woman. To say, okay, I know I was raped, but I have no proof that I was raped. So what do I do? Damn, man. What you does that mean? Up, you fucking up, Wait, black you, girl. You, you, you got to ease up on that word, black girl. But at the end of the day, that is her job to figure that out. I ain't got to figure that out. She got to figure that out. And, and you I know mean, what? And I think, I think, I think hold on, black girl. Hold on, black girl. But, but if, no, no, that black happens to, if that happens no, no. to somebody you care about, you know, your no, daughter, black you know, I, I get sister. You, but, but that's why I've told the women I care about, you don't go off and be alone with a man that you don't sexually consent to. They have a and what did I, what, what, How did I preface my prior statement? That's why I said the problem is men and women spend too much unchaperoned time with each other. Well, well, that's I'm, why not, I'm, not even, I'm not arguing. I'm not arguing. With, with 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 that particular uh, piece of what you said, I, hey, it is what it is. So my thing is, I don't care what woman it is. I've said before, the rules don't change because I love somebody. You do not go off with a man that you ain't trying to sexually consent to. That's your standard as a woman. So Roger. you will be okay, and you won't get caught up in nonsense. Roger, can I can I run this past you? You might not agree with it, but I'm just gonna be honest with you, bro. I'm like most men, and most men do this. We pick and choose. Okay? What happens is is that men that may be closely associated with us, we may give more validity to their claims. And women that aren't closely associated with us, we we lend them less credence. So the issue is, is that, for instance, if we have daughters, mothers, sisters, cousins, these things may get a little bit more scrutiny. We we may believe them a little bit more. 
we may investigate it. But, you know, I I investigate it. I'm not talking about other men. Um, I investigate it, but you know, men men are much more likely to go to bat for those at the drop of a hat. Okay, regardless of whether there was or was not proof, and so you end up with a situation. Especially when you start to bring, because right now this is this is essentially the stance of the legal system, whereas <laughs> they're now you know, they're, yeah, that's where yeah. we're at. And and, so, and, but that's men believing all women. That's what the problem is. You have men believing all women. I have no reason to believe a stranger. So what do you do in a situation when you're accused, rather than like her having to prove without reasonable doubt or reasonable doubt rather? That's only the trial part. Imagine you being accused. I'm a half a million dollars in a hole right now just for being accused. So she didn't have to prove anything to accuse me. She had, she would have no. to prove it on the trial stance. But from the preliminary part, I'm I'm five hundred dollars in debt right now because I was accused. And anybody can be accused, no, no. right, Bro, brother? I totally get where you're coming from. And the whole thing is, you not five hundred thousand in the hole if men simply require. Some proof. She has to go to a grand jury and everything. Okay, do you got some evidence against this guy? Well, no, I don't have no evidence against the guy, but I I, I believe he did it though. Okay, we don't we're not taking this to trial. You ain't got no evidence. It's, it's that simple at the end today. This stuff get real easy when we just stand up on our principles. Everything get real easy that way. Well, not every single thing, but most things get real clear and real easy if we just stand up on something. Why am I doing this show today? Because I got some woman attacking Bill Cobby. Did she provide any level of proof that Bill Cobby did anything wrong and in, in the stuff that she put together? Absolutely not. Did she pro provide any proof that Mike Tyson did something wrong? Absolutely.